Hi booktube, Thea here and this video is just going to be a real quick uh, mini haul of the books and the bookish things that I picked up today at the full of books here in my city. So I'll just go ahead and get right in and show you guys what I got. So the first thing that I picked up, um, I actually got from Epic Reads, I'll give you a free tote. And so on the front it says Epic Reads. And then on the back, it says, I'd rather be reading. I could always use with new totes. I love totes. It's um, a really nice heavy duty one. So I picked this up from Epic Reads. The next two things also came from Epic Reads. They were giving away uh, some free bookish things. And so the first thing that I got is this foam uh, glass sword. And it says February 9, 2016. And then on the back, it says, kneel or bleed. Still haven't read Red Queen or Glass Sword yet, but it was really cute. It'll be really cute on my bookshelf next to the copy of the book. Next thing from Epic Reads uh, is a poster. It's a quote from The Siren by Kara Cass, and it says, There's always room for love, even if it's as small as a crack in the door. Um, so this was free. I haven't read The Siren yet. I've been wanting to. It's on my TBR. So I picked up this uh, poster, and I'm putting the poster probably against the bookshelf um, somewhere after. These also, these also came from Epic Reads. Um, they are little excerpts from uh, new releases. Sh uh, Shepherd's Crown by Terry Pratchett. I believe it's just like the first, uh, the first chapter. So I thought I'd pick that up, little, give it a little read. Picked up A Study in Charlotte, the excerpt. I believe it's the first chapter on that as well. Uh, the Lifeboat Click by Kathy Parks. Uh, this is actually on sale as of March 1st, so this is currently already on sale. Um, not sure how many chapters this is. Uh, looks like it's the first three or four chapters, so I'll give that a read. Sing by Vivi Green. This is on sale June 7th, um, and I believe this looks like it's the first uh, five chapters of that. also picked up The Improbable Theory of Anna and Zach by Brian Catch, and this is on sale now. Looks like it's a, like a chapter or two in that. It doesn't have uh, what numbers they are. So I picked up those little excerpts. Um, go ahead and give this a Pride and Prejudice bookmark. It says, next to being married, a girl likes to be crossed a little in love now and then. And it's really cute, laminated. It's got the little ribbon. Um, this is going to look really nice in my Jane Austen bind up. Now onto the books that I picked up. These are the paperback books that I did pick up. Uh, three of these I did pay for and one of them was uh, a free book that they actually were having the author sign. It's Good Omens by Neil Gaiman and Terry Pratchett. I really love Neil Gaiman and so I'm going to go ahead and give this a read. The next book I picked up is The Curious Incident of the Dog in the Nighttime. A novel by Mark Haddon. I've been wanting to read this book um, since I have heard about the play and this is the book that the play is based off of so I wanted to pick this up. Books um, are all used but it is in great condition and it's only three dollars so I figured I'd pick it up and give it a read. Next I picked up uh, Fahrenheit 451 by Ray Bradbury because I don't have a copy of this. It's crazy um, but again this was a used copy. It was like three dollars so I picked it up. Also, um, this is a book that was free. Uh, I was passing along uh, one of the booths and they were saying free book, have the author sign it. And that is called Sentiment, a memoir by Cheryl Kroc. Um, not even really sure about this book. Um, I know it takes place during uh, the 1950s in uh, Chicago and it's a memoir about uh, the, her immigrant uh, grandparents a fragile mother, a, a center compassionate father, and the experiences that helped form a framework for understanding her world and navigating through life. Uh, it's a pretty hefty book, um, but it's uh, got lots of pictures and um, it, you know, it's free. Give it, you know, I'm always about supporting local authors and she did actually sign it. We're gonna give it a read eventually, you know, um, pretty big, but the last shot. three books that I picked up are all hardback. I've been slowly collecting the series in hardback, and so I picked up Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince by J.K. Rowling. Um, this is used, but it's in still really, really good condition. It was $5, so I could not pass up getting this in hardback. And the last two books are the first two in a series. The third one has not been released yet. I picked them up, and that is The Cuckoo's Calling, Silkworm. Um, 
like to read them. They were, again, they're used, but they were $5, so they're still in really good condition, and um, so I could not pass them up, so um, I picked up both of those. So that's everything from day one of uh, the book festival. Uh, leave me any comments below of any of these books shown here today that you've read or that you want to read. Um, and uh, leave all my social stuff below. And I look forward to the next video. Bye, guys.